Hello guys, um, my name is Kazim Olanino. So I want to show you guys one important feature on Windows PC. So if you have a PC that uses a Windows operating system, I don't know if you guys have heard of heard about Windows God Mode. The Windows God Mode is also known as Windows Master Control Panel. And what is the Windows God God Mode? The Windows God Mode gives you quick access. So all the settings that are clickable on your Windows PC. That is to say, it's, it gives you quick two-step access to any setting that you might need. And it has more than 200 settings, the, set, the menu settings available when you open um, the God Mode on your desktop. So I'm going to be showing us how to create the Windows God Mode and how to tweak any settings from that in a bit. So a quick um, little history here. The Windows God Mode actually originated with uh, Windows Vista. You guys remember Windows Vista in 2007? And luckily, it is usable on your Windows 10 and Windows 11 PC. That means it originated in 2007 with Windows Vista. But you can also use it if you use a Windows 10 PC or the latest OS, which is Windows 11. You can also use the Windows God Mode. So what you need to do is just to put the God Mode on your desktop. And I will show you how to do that in a bit. Okay, now this is my desktop PC. I'm going to create a God mode on this my desktop so that I can access any settings quickly and do it. So what you need to do on your desktop is to create a folder on your desktop. So I will show, okay, these are the steps. So you right click on your desktop. When you right click to open a context menu. You go to new from the new then you create a folder create a folder now the name you're going to give this folder i will type it out in, it, it, it's quite long maybe you guys can put it down on paper because it's, it's very long that will allow us to transform this folder into an icon that looks like the control panel that we are used to so you're going to type god mode this way, G O D M O D E. Then it has a dot. Then open a curly brace. Then capital E D seven B A four seven zero hyphen eight E eight E five four hyphen four six five sorry 465 e then another another hyphen 825 c 825 c another hyphen 9971 e 01 c then you close the curly brace it's a bit long right so when you finish typing this, then you hit the enter key on your keyboard. Once you hit the enter key, can you see what happened? It changes to the icon of the control panel. Now, this is now the God mode on your PC. So let's open up the God mode and see what we have there. If I double click to open it, all right, I have this. Guys, look at, look at something. The name is God mode. So this is the God mode now. Now, these are all the settings. Actually, why do we need to use the God mode? Because it gives us quick access to all the settings right here. Can you see all the clickable settings on your PC? You don't have to enter, go through the control panel, administrative templates, to go to administrative, administrative tools, or go through a long process to access a particular settings. Everything has now been brought to a single tab, to a single window tab. So let's see if I scroll down here. If I scroll down here, okay, let me start from here. If you want to create or you want to format your addicts partitions, you can do that here. If you want to edit group policy, you can do that here. If you want to free up the disk space on your hard drive by delete on this, you can quickly do that here. And if you want to schedule tax as well. And also you want to def uh, defragment and optimize your drives. Another thing I want to show is that you can there are a lot of things. I mean, I love this gold mode. I love I, it, it actually used to save me time. If you want to back up and restore your OS, you can do it there. And let me scroll down. Okay, you want to change the date and time. You just okay. Let's click on this. 
to change the date and time, I double click to see. Instantly, I do what I want to do, I close it, and I'm done. Also, there are other things that I'm going to, be, I'm going to, I'm going to show you as well. You want to set the date and time, okay, this one is to change the time zone. Uh, let me scroll down and see other options I will add here. Okay, you want to add a Bluetooth device, you don't have to go through the tax bar and be looking for where the Bluetooth is. Instantly, you do that here, you add a device here. You want to go to device manager. Maybe you want to see the drivers that are updated or that needs updates. You do that here as well. Your printer, you connect your PC to your printer. You want to customize some settings or change some settings there. You do that there. You scroll down as well. You see other things that you can do quickly. The God mode actually gives you quick access to all the customizable settings that you have on your window. You want to change how your keyboard works. You do that here. How your mouse works. You do that here. And okay. You want to turn off background image. I mean, who wouldn't like a god mode on his or her PC? Okay, I'm just trying to see other things that we can do. You want to change first font settings of your file manager and the rest, you do that here. And you want to allow dogs or pop ups. I mean, this is great. This is great. Now, look at all these settings. Any settings you want to apply quickly to your mouse, as in to the cursor, to the mouse cursor, you do that here as well. And if it's for network, you do that here as well quickly. Instead of, instead of trying to look for control panel, going through the tab settings, a long process, this one gives us quick settings. Now look at the power options as well. Instantly, you can change battery settings, choose a power plan, and the lots of them. Um, let me also try and open some other things. Alright, you want to change sound settings, you do that here as well. You want to set up a microphone or start speech recognition. You can also do that here. Okay. You want to rename this computer. You know, if you want to rename this computer, you have to go to the control panel, the user account, then go to, I mean, like four, five, or seven step process. But here now, if you want to rename this computer, I'll just double click this. Once I double click it, okay, I'll wait for you to pop up instantly. It gives me access to that feature. I can do what I you see instantly. I do what I want to. This, this is the current this is the current name of my PC. So instantly I'll do that. I'll change the name. I mean, I'm lot. I, I can't. I, I just can't stop loving this God mode. And there are a lot of settings. So if you if you're able to follow the process through and you put a God mode icon on your PC, go through them and see different settings that you can quickly customize on your Windows PC. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys like this little trick that has been in existence since 07 that many people don't know about. And I hope you like it. So if you like it, let me like this video as well. Thank you for watching.